Please welcome Jeff Hunt, the chairman of the Western Conservative Summit, and Frank Atwood from Approval Voting. All right, Frank, we have the results of the straw poll. Man, I, I've got to tell you, I think that speech by Diamond and Silk will go down in the history as the greatest speech ever given at the Western Conservative Summit. That was, a, that was just remarkable. Okay, we did two different straw polls. One was a traditional poll, similar to what you see in a, in a traditional ballot. Uh, and then Frank's going to talk a little bit about approval voting and uh, how it's a little bit different. All right, the winner of the 2018 Western Conservative Summit gubernatorial poll is Greg Lopez. <laughs> Greg Lopez won with 39% of the vote. There we go. Walker Stapleton finished a close second with 36% of the vote. Victor Mitchell finished third with 17% of the vote. And Doug Robinson finished fourth with 7.5% of the vote. And a handful of people are liberals and voted for Jared Polis and Donna Lynn. Um, Frank, do you want to talk about approval voting? Thank you very much. Thank you, Jeff, for letting me talk about approval voting. The two least sexy topics with regards to elections and politics. One is ballot access and the other is voting methods. And we witness too many spoilers, too much sabotage, and I'm one of those that believe the solution is to change the voting method to what's called approval voting. And so briefly summing up approval voting is vote for all you want. What that means for major parties is fewer spoilers and less sabotage. For minor parties, it means more viability and visibility. For you, the voter, more honesty. And for some voters, it may mean shorter showers after voting. <laughs> so the results, the question asked with the approval voting question that uh, some of you voted in, Check all the candidates you would support for governor. Vote for multiple candidates. And our results were Greg Lopez again was first place at 64%. Closely followed by Walker Stapleton at 60%. Then followed by Victor Mitchell at about 39% and Doug Robinson at 30%, and then again, a few follow stragglers in the mix. What this shows is that the individuals here approve and are supportive of all of the candidates and that they re re represent the crowd. Thank you. Great. Thank you, Frank. Thank you. Great, thank you all so much for voting in the uh, straw poll as well. This will be released to press. This is an important indicator on where the grassroots conservatives stand in this state.